Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for the 5th, or around the 5th, right? So, because the timing is fluid, so around the 5th. Um, this reading is not sign specific. It is, uh, if it's meant for you, it's meant for you. If it's not, it's not. Take what resonates and leave, leave the rest, okay? So, let's just see what we, ooh, the Nine of Pentacles come flying out. So, this is enjoying life, being grateful for your experiences. This is somebody that uh, is doing very, very, very well independently. This person um, has a lot of strength, has a lot of stamina, has a, a lot of worth, self-worth, self-value. Um, this person has worked really, really hard to obtain security. Um, this person is very valuable and they know it. Um, so we have a, a very independent person who's doing quite well on their own. Ooh, and there's about to be some sort of uh, revelation, reveal, um, truth, resurrection, reconciliation perhaps. This person has done a lot of work and now something, it's like this, something's being given to this person. This person that has worked really, really hard is about to get something. This person may have went through some sort of spiritual awakening as well. This person may be receiving a call from somebody. Okay, because this is a call, it's a judgment call, but it could also be a telephone call. Okay, this is a call. This is an epiphany. This person may be receiving some sort of epiphany as well. Some sort of um, message. Hmm. Ooh. Now, somebody may be wanting to come back. Okay. Okay, this is coming back. There could be a reconciliation here for some of you. It could be. This could even be a past life connection. So for those of you who have that have a one-track mind and are automatically going to your ex, no. Okay, it could be. But this could go so many different ways. There is somebody coming back around that um, you may have dealt with in the past. Okay. This is letting go of the past hurts. Somebody is definitely thinking about it. Somebody is thinking about coming back. That's for sure. They're thinking about a reconciliation or they're thinking about communicating something. So they may actually do it. I'm not sure. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Somebody hasn't been putting in enough effort. They may say that. They may say, I'm sorry, I didn't put in. This could be an apology. It could be. Somebody may deliver some sort of apology. You know, I didn't put in effort when I should have. That could be the case. I don't know. Um, three of Swords reverse. This is, this is healing. This is forgiveness. Letting go of the pain. Somebody may be asking, this is forgiveness and this is forgiveness. So somebody may be asking for forgiveness. They may. They may have seen a person's growth, a person's rise from the ashes. So they may have been watching a person rise. What do we got here? Ooh, two of wands at the moment of decision. Somebody is really thinking about stepping into unknown territory or going back to something they once knew. Hmm. Oh yeah, somebody definitely wants to come back, okay? Somebody definitely wants to come back. There's there's no doubt, okay? Um Seven of Cups. 
somebody may have been uh, made a poor choice okay they didn't put in effort and they see you know their poor decision making that could certainly be the case now now they're definitely thinking about uh, what their options are they're thinking about the pain that was caused as well so I don't know who this reading is for it will not resonate with every single person but somebody is thinking about forgiveness they're thinking about will they be forgiven they're thinking about going back they're thinking about um, resurrecting with somebody that has done a lot of work this person has done a lot of work on themselves a lot this person has brought themselves up from rock bottom and has come to a point of success I feel like we have somebody here that wants to approach but they don't quite dare to they may have been immature in the past they may have been inexperienced in the past um, you could be dealing with a Pisces, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, you got everybody here, it really doesn't matter. But there is an opportunity for some sort of reconciliation. Somebody may want a reconciliation. Somebody may receive a telephone call, put it that way. It might not, ha might not be a telephone call, it might be something else. But this could also be some sort of an epiphany. Somebody may receive some sort of epiphany about um what they left behind they may have been they may have made a poor decision that didn't move in the direction they, they didn't move in the right direction okay they didn't uh do the right thing somebody didn't do the right thing this is they weren't noble somebody didn't do the right thing they may have acted impulsively or something i don't know somebody is lacking confidence okay also we got somebody here that is lacking confidence to express themselves okay so it's like i think we have somebody here that wants to express maybe they they want to apologize or they they're hoping for forgiveness but they they they, they lack confidence in communicating because they probably feel as though this person is too strong now um What else do we got here? Ooh, somebody didn't focus on a relationship when they should have. Somebody did not focus on a relationship and now there's a loss. Now there's a loss. It's like, it's the, it's, this is like a dying dream. They may realize, this is realizing that they lost the best relationship ever. Seriously, that's what this is. So somebody may be realizing that they lost something really, 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 really good and they may you know communicate they may ask for a chance this is a chance they may want another chance so i feel as though there's an opportunity to give somebody another chance should they communicate um are they going to communicate um Somebody's going to be receiving something. They are going to be receiving something, but you know, you get what you give and you get what you deserve. And it feels as though we have somebody here that may want to uh, balance things out. They may want to now give to a situation that they didn't reciprocate with in the past. They may be really intimidated by the person that they are about to communicate with or that they want to communicate with. This person may be um, bitter resentful uh, vindictive whatever a little bit um, intimidating so they we definitely have somebody here that is feeling the loss of a relationship uh, because they did not um, do the right thing when it was time and I think now you know they're seeing you know they're seeing their the their own illusion or, or they're really confused as to whether they should step forward or not confused as to they're marrying each other confused as to whether they should step forward um they didn't put in effort in the past and it feels like now they're ready to forgive and they're hoping for forgiveness okay so they are 
probably going to communicate, whether it's via text or message or whatever, you're, somebody is going to receive communication from somebody. And there's an opportunity to move forward. These are also the rods of love. This person probably, you know, has feelings, okay? Um... So I do believe that somebody is going to receive a message from somebody that may have, uh, they may have left behind in the past or, you know, vice versa. Somebody was, somebody was left behind, okay, with that eight of cups. Somebody had left and now there's an opportunity to reconcile, okay? This could be somebody... This is somebody that you know or somebody that you are very, very, very familiar with, okay? Um, so, yeah, that's what I got. Good luck.